Hello, everybody, and welcome to Race Weekend. We are here with the Champions Division in the Champions Series. We'll be starting just in a second. We are here in Austria for today's race. Woot, it, woot. it is a sprint event, which means we will have a short qualifying into a sprint event into our main event. The sprint event will be around 33% of the main event, which is a 50% race. Um, so let's see what they are up Wait, to. What's your name? Who are you? Who am I talking to? I am Stinky One. I'm oh, here. No. I am the Stinky One. I'm here with Who am I? my fellow commentator, Ivor Zim. Hello. Thank you for reminding me. You're I welcome. didn't even realize I That's just I'm here for. didn't say my name. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Ooh. I'll give it all. Oh. <clears throat> oh. Here we are in Spielberg, Austria. Today, the, oh, I didn't see the track distance. God damn it. <laughs> I wanted to. <sighs> Ten corners. Ten corners. Three sectors. You're going to miss it again. 4.318 kilometers and 2.683 miles. There's three DRS zones today. Are, are there three? Yeah, there's three in this Holy track. Shit. It's one, it's one of the shortest tracks, and it has three DRS zones. One on the front straight, one on the second straight, and then one on oh the God. third straight. It's literally three in a row. So what happens is on this track, there's just going to be these long DRS trains. Like it's gonna, it's very hard to get rid of a driver off the back of you. It's on, a square. in this track. Kind of, not really, but sort it's of. a square that you punched a hole in. I punched it. You just kind of like, yeah. here, I'm just going to step on it. Oh, so you stepped on a box, and yeah. that's your foot. Oh, yeah. <laughs> your foot. You stepped on it. Yeah. You accidentally stepped on it. I see it. Desparangara Did I get that right? Desparangara. That's the wrong guy. Desparangara. No, I did. Yeah, so that is the track. what you wanted um yeah um, let me go check the lobby appreciate that all right appreciate since uh that. art's here um what were we gonna ask them oh can you uh ask them to make their use their names uh public public or show names for show, me please show names if you please, can mr art because i would really appreciate it so i can easily do their names All right, it looks like we have it starting up. We actually have an extra space. We still don't have 20 drivers here for the race. We're not supposed to. We're supposed to. One's I don't late. know One's who. Rizzo, remember? No, I think he. I think he's in here. I guess he we'll only out. has three people in Teamspeak, guys. Well, ah, sorry. If he could do it, yeah, in Discord. I don't know. It they won't matter. I I'm just asking in the hopes that there will be at least two drivers that do it, so at least it's two less I have to worry about. Bro, what is Brian's outfit in game? This is a man who you is, know he prides himself in his. I'm asking you. I I hate when I stare at. I see his guy. It's just it's just terrible. His guy in game is so terrible. Yeah. Oh my gosh. He's he gonna, really likes to make sure that he he presents the character that, that he wants. He's got that Tour de France build. Tour going. de France. All right, here we are going back in. Should we do it again? <sighs> Welcome. <laughs> do you like a whole new intro? Yeah, sure. He's wearing just underwear and a shirt. It's not, it's like, bike, it's biking, right. it's just biking. Like, oh, they're just biking shorts? That's why I said Twitter La Fonsville. Mal. Yeah, it's like the biking shorts. I didn't shorts. realize. But, yeah, <laughs> it's biking shorts. He's, you know, he's yeah. an athletic guy. He likes to get out there. Yeah. All right, so round two of trying to get the Austrian, Austrian Grand Prix started in the Champions Division. I am your host, Stinky Juan. I am here with commentator Iverzim. Hello. Y'all yeah, love there. <laughs> How are you today? Uh, you know, right. so you just you know do your best. Go out there. You know, it's all good. Whatever happens, happens. It's not your fault. Yeah, it's EA. We can blame EA and confidently know it's them. 
We're not we're not potting blame off on anyone there. We're literally not just reporting all. facts. Click, click, click. Clickety, clack, clack. I mean, it definitely wasn't your fault. No. There's no reason. You don't even have control at that point. <laughs> you couldn't even be that fault until then. I want to stay here, though, because I want to see if it happens to anyone else. Yeah. So what I think happened is it, a car was coming down, right? And it was coming. It was another and one, one was, was coming start. out. Yeah. Like this. Yeah. And then. No. What happened to a different one? Don't do this to me. Are you kidding me? Go back. What is going on? It was the Mercedes. That's amazing. Who's that Mercedes? I don't know who that is. Oh wait, wait, wait. Other car, oh no, 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 other car, we're good, we're good! No, I think he left to make it work. Oh, really? Oh, well, can he join back? I think he retired. He never, he never left, the, I think he retired his car to make sure that, I don't know what's going on there. That's a glitch that I've never seen in the game before. Yeah. It's a okay, bad I'm one. I'm gonna bring um, yeah, my I, thing back up while you I need that. that. I need that up anyways. Because uh, I need it for should. names. Yeah, I wonder if he just was like, all right, well, I don't want to do that again. Velveeta? 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 Let's take a look at Sway, see how he's doing out there. Ooh, look at those billboards. Wow, what nice billboards. I need to find. He's Sway's the Italian, right? Brown Sway. Wait, that's is that what he uses in the race? Nope. See, I knew that was wrong. The Brit for Williams is whom? means I need you to move this. Oh. He's not British. Is it Galaxy? Galaxy who is... Alrighty, and we got some fastest lap times coming in. Lord so far with a 105.651. We have a 105.679 and another 105 from Thomas. All these names are gonna change because we use the driver's preferred names um, in our overlays. All right, I'm under the assumption. Galaxy, are you here? What is your name in the game? Just do Galaxy. No, but he he's one of these drivers. I just don't know who. Go to EA News. This is too many channels. It's done. It's up. Galaxy Field Wave. Yeah, I think he's at the top somewhere. Um, I'm gonna hop around the track. Yeah. And There's no reason to watch me. I mean, I got distracted. Ooh, Limp, I see you with a 104 6, 1, 6, Getting in there. Um, so why didn't you just like... Oh, this is Finn. Finn? This is Kumar. This is Thomas. 
and the singular hoss is So yeah, Fapa, if you can get a hold of Clicky, Clicky can get you into the race. Dude, what is happening? Um, what are you talking about? So this is not the same order that they have it in the game. So whenever they don't have a marker, you just have to yeah, keep going down if you're trying to get to a specific driver. I hate that. It's un When they get a time down, it's fine. But yeah. Um, we haven't, like, seen anyone do that. We're gonna go to... Oh. Sorry. I was over here, though. How did I... Project being the sacrificial lamb. Yeah. Shout out to him, though. Yeah, that's... Yeah, Lannan being the real... Uh... Just take him off the team. He took one for the team hardcore there. Yeah, hardcore. But the thing is, is these, as these drivers need to remember that we are in a sprints um yeah event. This isn't the so race. this is just qualifying for qualifying essentially yeah so yes it's gonna be harder for him in the beginning but i've we've seen it numerous times we saw it in real life hamilton did it like was able to gain from the furthest back up into points I and then going all the way up into understand. the next points what what do you not understand A lot of things, honestly. Yeah, please stop. See, this is why you do don't use it, and I use it. Okay, here you go. Here you go. <laughs> this Here's is the camera. This is camera. why you just like here you go. ADDing the camera right now. I'm sorry that I think I have it and I'm undiagnosed. <laughs> I would admit it'll explain a lot of things about me, honestly. If I, if like, you know. Yeah. <laughs> what? Just so, yeah. he, you thought I was gonna be hesitant on it? <coughs> no, All right, I, mean, I so, would have liked it if you lied to me. So little. we have, you know, what we should do though. Um, since we are, <laughs> what? The game literally could not process oh, what was happening there that he was went so hard amazing. into that wall amazing i want i want to replay that wind <laughs> it back wind it back oh that was amazing. the man ghosted back to the track went back to the thing my favorite part was that he went back onto the track and then and his then wings <laughs> it exploded on him um that is unfortunate though uh But since we're here, we should sit inside these cars. We'll drop down the audio of it. Just I so like that sitting can, inside the cars. We can, uh, I don't think we do it enough. So in the race, we want to be on the outside so that we can see everything. But for qualifying, there's no reason not to be inside. So we could sit in the for qualifying, uh, you know? And we can enjoy all the wonderful... Uh, oh, he's pulling over um, for... It looks like Luke was doing a lap. Delta Zero stuff. And, uh, so we'll be here with some coaches and moves. We'll be here with and Luca. In the Haas, I think he's the only Haas driver out there today. I think there's supposed to be more. Yeah, let's bring it up to time two. Ooh, I like this a lot. Yeah, but we have that right there too. <laughs> so. Yeah, but this is bigger than this. And it's in it a That's not the correct. It's not all of them. What do we do? I usually do timetables because it allows me to know kind of who exactly you watch. Stuff. Yeah, but we, like we see, he's doing some good, doing a faster lap. Should get. Oh, I guess they're always oh, all going to be personal best. Uh, our good friend Miller uh, spent lots and lots and lots of time on it. Oh, and we gave him the curse. And then I gave him unsolicited advice as to what I thought it should be, without putting any work into it. 
and all right so we have first. here tesos is about to get ready to do a lap here or is doing he's doing an in lap it looks like nope that's yeah, finishing this lap let's see Oh, Ooh. we see Broken there doing a 104.553. Ooh, gets real close to that car. He was, <laughs> was really trying to get that really draft. Uh, oh. Ooh, really late break. Oh, this is the mark. Glitch. Yeah. Looks like the glitches have proceeded through from last, from yesterday. Um, but it seems like it's fine. And then they go off track and then it starts glitching, so I hopefully know. it's only an off track thing. I'll get in that draft from that driver. I don't know. I've tried to, uh, we've used this game a lot, right? Spent yep. a lot of time in it. Spent a lot of time in the last game, right? Mm -hmm. And I still do not, fundamentally I do not understand, like, why it's just a You know? Um, I mean, I could get it, but I don't. Yeah. So we're here with Renzo coming in to the final corner. He comes across the line, does a better lap of a 105.195. Moving up into third. Moves himself into P3 here. Very important for that um, Ferrari group. Trying to stay ahead of the um, McLarens. And the, the, I believe, the Alpines are doing well as well. Mm -hmm. I think they're about 20, 20 points off. There will be some nice team battles, I think, this season, especially now that Definitely. we have a fuller grid, you know, more consistent drivers. Um, and, you know, I would just there's some talented drivers out there. So it's nice to see the competition really actually, like, playing out in the points. Yeah. But, you know, I'm not surprised when I see the McLaren and the Ferraris right now. But it doesn't surprise me. Oh! That car tries tries not to block, so it just goes into the sand trap. Hopefully, it doesn't get stuck in there. Dude, I mean, can you like? I wonder if when you're off, you can reset though. Maybe that's what he tried to do, and that's why I put him over there. I have no idea what happened. That was know, insane. Really. But he went back, so I know. Maybe the game was like, oh no, just <laughs> kidding. Like, you don't no, have to you're, do that. You're, you're already out. <laughs> you're ready. He like, did it at the same time in hopes of like not DNFing his car, maybe. I'm afraid to go to Luca. I don't want to screw him up again. Look away, Luca. Look <laughs> away. We have Paul here coming out. On an outlap. Sunday driving. Um, so the one thing about this qualifying is the, the drivers who have actually been able to put out a lap that's been good, they're going to have less stress because like this track is so short. So mm -hmm. getting out there trying to not get in people's way and then doing a good lap without somebody else getting in the way is very difficult here. Yeah. Especially if, when you get like 20 drivers out there all together and... Yeah, I mean, I'm looking forward to the sprint race though. I, I've always, I like them as like a medium of racing, you know what I mean? Like, I, I like it as a way to get to the real race. The regular race, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't know, I think it just adds another opportunity for competition, you know? Definitely, it gives you less urgency also for the drivers in the back, so you can be a little bit more safe, you can use a little bit more strategy, uh, gain a few positions here or there, lose a few positions here or there. Like, it allows you to and, take your time in the weekend. And the then way. you can go into the race. Yeah. I I think some of the, there being the ability to have points in the sprint can maybe make it a little bit more difficult because people are going to be pushing a little harder because they want yeah. that point, right? Um, but, but you know, I think it, it makes sense because you're risking your car in there. So it's like, yes, maybe there should be points allowed, and that's what they ch chose to do uh, mm -hmm. with it. Having in the sprint race, you get eight for getting first, and then seven, six. Five, I think four, it's six, some four. points. You know what I mean? Like some yeah. points make sense. Yep. Yeah. Same amount of points. No. Some points, yes. Yeah, they originally had it just for the top three. Mm -hmm. Let's see it. Let's see it. But not better. Oh no, Bennett. does improve. 106, does 106, yeah. My apologies. Gets into the mid pack. This mid pack is going to be scary. It's, um, it's, it's, uh, 
Is this it's, a lot of it's gonna be a gauntlet, man. Like last time, every race we've had, there's just been like the the front pack. You get like the few drivers here or there that are are gonna be better like on this. Three or four that are gonna um, try and like sneak away. Yes, and then you have the mid pack, which is just a full on. Everybody's just fighting. Everybody's pretty equal there. Like from the top to the bottom, they're all just training. And we did see Luca did a faster lap of a 105.502. So, you know, it's good we didn't watch him. He was able to do a nice he fast able to lap improve. here. All right, so now we're going to be here with Miller. He's doing an out lap with Renzo. I think they're the only two drivers out there. Oh, Lord, Lord is out is there also, out also there. doing an out lap. Everybody else has already done their lap, and I think they're trying to come in to do another lap. Um, so these guys are going to be coming mm -hmm. really close to it here. We have Miller here. Trying his to time warming up his tires. Oh, he's trying to drain that that in, that fuel right now. For oh, sure. Good? Yeah, he's high revving it, staying out of people's way, letting people through. Just random fuel. I'm gonna, sorry. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave the camera. He, he won't he won't run out of fuel. He won't. No draining his fuel. He's just. Oh yeah, yeah yeah yeah. It's harder on this track too. Oh oh, you uh, don't think he was hindering anybody? Oh. Uh, man, that was a heavy snap. We see people, uh, Valhetti now getting a 105.329, so people are going faster right now. I didn't even realize he was doing a lap. I thought he was just on an in-lap. Same. But gets that Red Bull into P4. But, like, look, it says that Miller's on an in-lap now. Yeah. You know? But now Miller is doing his hot lap, so maybe there was a few drivers that were on hot laps. Huh? Yeah. And we could not tell. Um... Uh, we're here with Miller now doing his lap. We do have Limp coming out. He's on an out lap. And we have Renzo right in front of him, who's also doing a hot lap as well, doing a 15.959 for Miller. And Renzo does a 16.159. So about a tenth off from Miller here through sector one. Yeah, it can be hard to keep it. The second the sector tree, is know? definitely the most difficult mm -hmm. uh, on this track. Oh, and Miller bails out on bails his on lap his here. Lap. It's an interesting one. And we have here Limp. Take a look at Limp. Look at Limp, so yeah, he's comparable. I, I, hear, I hear a motor, the, motor weapon. Yeah, comparable time here with, uh, with Miller. Let's see what his sector two looks like. Yeah, Miller had a good sector too. I, that was an interesting bail. I wonder why he bailed out on that. Um, that was scary. Yeah, <laughs> I think he might have ghosted through there. He did. He did. Because he, he was he's definitely gonna hit him, right? Uh huh. Oh. Park is dangerous. No, Luca, you. Gotta keep so he's gonna go from seventh all the way to the back now. That is rough. Limp and Limp goes fast as a 104.381. And so I think we have to mention here, spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. Limp is on a three race win streak for this season. And he's actually technically con continuing it from previously. Yeah. So it's like 20. So he's on, it's on a long one. He's on a long win streak. Here. All right. I think we got Renzo. Um, he's going to come across the line again. But for this season, he has been unbeatable. Uh, so it'd be nice. We'll, we'll see what happens in this one. Tesos uh, doing really well here again with getting not, himself in P4. Lap, no. He's setting himself up for one? No. No, he's, no, he's, he's already gone slow. through the line. So I think Velheti might be the only one. No. He's in the pits. Thomas might have done a lot, but I think most of these guys are done. Yep. Oh, yeah. 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 This is wrapped up. Thing. We're done. So, well Limp done. Does it again. So, we got Limp, Miller, Renzo, Tesos. I can't do it like this because the names are wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. It's just the qualifying for the qualifying. For the qualifying? For the qualifying. The qualifying. 
Sprint time. Sprint time. Yeah, this is going to be... Um, I believe all of them are going to most likely put on mediums. Probably. I wouldn't expect any of them to go into the hards they, or the softs. Because how many? Because is, how many laps is the sprint? It's twelve, so it's just barely. I think it's barely outside of the reach. Um, so from the last race, we saw these softs. They're they're pretty fast, but they drop off in <laughs> yeah, pace. The, the wear's rough so quickly. So you lose your pace on those tires almost immediately. <laughs> <Can I> blankets. <laughs> um, and because of that, you have to like the mediums are just going to be the tire for this track. They should go on softs and make it interesting. You know, that would that would make it interesting. It would make it interesting, but in a <laughs> that they all have to pit for another set pair, pair of softs. Yeah. Um the softs weren't crazy bad on this track. It's just you do a f- like five laps and then Will your, your you pace be able is just to bad. conserve your tires long enough yeah. to make it worth it. Probably I don't not. think so. I Probably think Probably not. This is most likely I can see a scenario in which somebody does the softs, but because of how strong the DRS is, mm-hmm. it's better to do like a medium hard or a, like what you want to do is make sure you're with the front group regardless. Yeah. So that's like the, I think the main, the main thing. Ooh, Wolfpack want. Performance. What nice branding you have, sir. Very nice. Very nice. All right, Non-aggressive so just, driving. Yeah. We need this because for some reason that always gets removed. I don't know why this gets removed. Why does it remove that from my settings? So, as we said, everybody on mediums, not a surprise. Um, Dude, I can't, I love that last time. Like everything? Yeah, it's just like I shouldn't, I've been looking at it for a couple days now, so it shouldn't still be so like. No, they're good. It's just cool. They look really nice. I like. I didn't. I, I now that I see that it's possible and like I, favorite, I understand how it was done. My favorite sector here. I like the Zinx one, dude. Yeah. The Zinx. The Zinx looks really clean. And then the little thing over there. I like their logo. It's cool. Very good. Yeah. I mean, as one would expect. As, as that one being would expect. A yep, that's what they do. Group. That's what they do. <laughs> no wonder it looks so good. <laughs> yeah. There they are again. <laughs> yeah, everybody needs it. Yeah, everybody's gonna go on the mediums. It's just the tire for this track. It just makes sense. It has the pace and the longevity that you're looking for for the entire race. There's not a real F1 race this weekend, is there? No, there's not. <sighs> so let's look here real quick. Unlike the other race, it does not look like there will be any rain no in sight. I will say this, though. With how the Champions Division has been going, very interesting. I am very happy it says there's not any chance of rain today. We don't, I, we we don't, don't need any more excitement. We've had so much rain this season. Oh, Galaxy was disqualified. I wonder if he overshot. Probably just overshot, yeah. Same with Valhetti and Kumar. But here we go. We're getting ready to start this sprint race. 12 laps. <clears throat> to set the, the grid for the race. All right, lights out. And away we go for the sprint race in Austria. We have All Link right. Miller, Tesos, Vilhack coming down to the front. Already <laughs> mixing it up a little bit. Tesos overcoming people a little bit wide Whoa, there. that jump on from Tesos there. Oh, three Gets wide. all the way into third or second. And doesn't this feel, this is nostalgia right here. This is exciting. Limp and Tesos. I like to see Limp it. Limp into Tesos. This is something uh, some of you new drivers wouldn't remember, but these two drivers, they used to live together. Mm-hmm. They were just like always, always next, battling. always one and two, always one and two. And look at this three wide through this corner. What is going on back here? Oh, and they're all still doing it. Goodness. This is a beauty. Oh my gosh. Renzo able to squeeze by. So Renzo said, I'm coming through here. Luke looks like he gets the worst out of all of that. Yeah. I can't believe they all try to fit through that corner. What happened to Luke? Did he go off track? I think he got, he ended up off, off of there, yeah. There wasn't room for three of them no, into not. that corner. There's barely room for two. Limp with the fastest alone. 110, 131. Yes, he gets the... It's pretty much 
whoever's in first. Well, yeah, I know, I know. Oh, and look at this little fight with Alex and Jonas. Jonas being set up, uh, had a really bad quality, I guess? Did not even, he's all the way back here. He started in somewhere back there. He's already six from six beyond, places, yeah. so he was 17th. Yeah, he was way back there. And gets some good positions. Finn also doing the same thing, even with those cold tires, getting some good mm -hmm. positions gained here. Luca doing from his disqualification. And then Miller gets working back up, back up to third. Oh yeah, Miller gets back up into third there. Um, we, we will try to keep following the action as best we, as we can. It is going to be hard because every little spot is going to look like there's a race because of Because everyone's really close. Because of the DRS zones. And we have a little fight here. I think Kumar uh, was passed by Mason there. So Mason doing a really good job here as a reserve driver. Been doing a really good job in reserving for the Champions Division. He did really well last race. Limp improving. Yeah, gets the fast stop of 106.595. And it looks like anybody else is doing better. We have Renzo here now attacking Talani. Talani getting a really good start for the race. I mm -hmm. think was in P3 at one point. And we missed the pass from Miller there. And Renzo now doing the same, trying to get a pass through here with the DRS now active. Though we will, he'll have to keep an eye on his back just to make sure mm -hmm. he doesn't try to check. Look it. So a lot of guys say they'll try to peek in through that corner. It's a very dangerous one. I think that's no. where a lot of incidences might happen here. Is somebody's trying to peek in through that last DRS zone? They're getting desperate because no. you want to pass them now because if you don't, you're kind of have to wait for the next DRS zones again um, or a mistake. No. But you're always waiting for that. <laughs> So we can see that we're now getting, it looks like, two DRS trains. I guess this one's not really a DRS train because uh, Limp did a really good job Ooh, of separating. Broken Hypocrite took it. But we can see Broken Hypocrite with a 105.722 getting the fastest lap and is kept trying to catch back into that toe now. Uh, being in, inside of somebody's DRS zone is very important on this track. It allows you to relax get, get, I mean you have to be, if you want to be competitive you have to stay in DRS zones in this track yes oh and you can see there I think Tolani just misses his break point and goes Mason wide with the penalty. there but actually gets oh, the pass Mason off fell here too. he was working his way up oh and Jonas DNF what happened I don't know I guess well so is it's this okay. the sprint? sprint he can it's go okay. into the next one but he was doing so well and oh and Luke out. does the same so Luca, Luca and Luke yeah, oh, yeah. Know. Sorry. Luca and Luke. Yeah, it's just, that's not confusing. Luca, Luke. So they both go out. So that's going to be tough, though, in the, the race there. They're going to have to push all the way through now, especially with some of these drivers now getting pushed up. Yeah. So some of these guys with a little bit faster uh, race pace are going to be up there higher. So it's going to be a little bit more difficult to get through. We see Hilly in there. Uh, we think he's our uh, P4. Renzo, you know, right drivers. there, looking for a spot to move. Yeah, Renzo now looking to attack. He's, he's we can ready. See Miller now on the back of. Oh, what is happening there? Whoa. Whoa. Did you see that? Yeah, that was. I don't know why that car is there. Oh, it looks like Renzo and Talani. They're doing the same thing again. It's part two of Pass Me on the Last DRS Zone. Pass Me, Pass You. No, but it looks like he's going to try to hold it, and he does hold it. Talani just concedes, but you nice. can see that Renzo already. Oh, oh off the track. Talani, that's, that you is lost a, it. Yeah, that's a hard one, man. It's an easy spot to lose your yeah. traction on, and with that, goes back. So, so Miller's all the way right here with six. Limp. Yeah, we Limp have Miller, Miller and Renzo. Together. I like it. That's a, that's a very nostalgic that's a, that's group a competitive, right there. That's a competitive one yeah. for so we have here Miller now in Limp's DRS, so we'll be able to sit there. We are on lap 6 of 12, so we'll see if... We'll see when they fight. Yeah. So he might wait a bit. Um, Miller's a patient driver. He's a very patient driver, so we'll see. We'll keep an eye. Looks like Kumar Mason's now out. on the attack of Tulani, and we get a safety car. Mason, yeah, that was his DNF. Oh no! Full safety car. It's a full safety car. That must car. have been rough. Can you? It looks like he's still on track. Um, who's near him? 
No one. I can't get to him unless someone's there. somebody drives fast. <laughs> They're gonna, probably gonna clip it soon. We'll just stay on them. Maybe it'll we'll stay. Around. Yeah, he's gone. It must have been just like it's a. Nice to crash. I mean, yeah. It looks like it was just a high speed. You're just trying to go through that corner really fast. And yeah. I think you get, it happens like I mean, it's it similar happens. to like Japan, where it's just you end up, you can like twitch into the wall. Yeah. Yeah, he spun and then just broke it right through that last corner. That's what I would expect. It's a pretty high speed corner, so makes sense. Um, I don't expect any of these front runners to go into the pits at all. No. Um, because you'll lose Except position. Chase us. Tesos going in. All right, well, he's not taking advice. I don't know. Advice. He's going for softs. So the thing about that is like... Talani's going for softs. You have to fight. So Talani, it makes sense. I think he broke his wing. So, you, you know, okay. we'll, we'll see here what this... When this right, eight, Talani, he went into the wall. He went into the wall. So, so it, this was, he's probably really happy So he that. wants to go in. And yeah, now he, he can try to fight through the pack again. But, but we'll have softs. They are a significantly faster tire. Because it's only a few laps, though, it's gonna be hard to see if he can get into the points again. He's gotta get him warmed up a little bit, and then he's gotta, he's gotta battle. Yeah, it's gonna be a hard battle. And but it's a sprint. We can see here Luke recovers back to his position from that really good start that resulted into that collision that happened. Valheri gets a three second penalty. So that's actually something we wanna look at penalties right now work. is that anybody has penalties. Renzo has a penalty, which means Thomas now is in P3 in without any, yeah. Oh man, he, he wants this safety car to end as soon as possible. But the problem is, is we had two drivers go into the pits. We are gonna pass, we already passed the uh, sector line, which means we'll do one more lap through here because they didn't say anything about resetting. Um, and I think we're getting close to, it might, it can't, I think sometimes it does trigger. Let's see if he can get onto the back and they trigger it. No, he's coming through the, yeah, he's already coming past the pit. So it's because we are coming through the pits now, we are doing one more lap around. I think this will be the last wrap, lap around. And wrap, then around. We, wrap around. Wrap around. Wrap around. Keep, wrap around. <clears throat> um, a good uh, thing to know is Lennon, good recovery into 10 now. Yeah. After sacrificing himself for the cause. Dude, so Jesus many. Christ, just this Renzo guy. I don't know. Well. <clears throat> All right, and it looks like. Okay, so it does look like Luca has come back in. So that's good. I I think, unfortunate sprint race but I, I think he has good pace so luca i think could, car, can yeah. really yeah safety car in this lap so we're expecting him to come in mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <clears throat> so here's my thing is i think that um yeah, keep talking. no i'm just thinking oh. I, my brain does this sometimes i think that a lot of these racers like Lane and Tesos Luke, for instance, does that 8, 9, 10 right now, for instance, are good examples of this. They kind of have, they have the qualities that are needed to be able to do this stuff. To be yeah. able to take, okay, I have four laps left, I'm in the sprint, I need to get into a better position, let's go. Like, All right, let's here we go. It, it looks like he's just off. He just immediately sends it. Renzo goes wide. Full send. It looks like he might be in danger now. By Thomas. Thomas is a very fast driver. Um, showed really good pace in um, Azerbaijan. And now is already looking to attack him. And is attacking this Ferrari through here. There's no DRS. They're all they're having to do this under their own power. Ooh, he's trying to squeeze in. Oh, this is Almost. really good. Close racing. Hey, oh, and Renzo's able to hold him for, for now. Um, we did see uh, Finn here getting passed through or getting through and this Williams, Williams team is together. looking really good. I don't know what Williams I don't know what happened. They where are this came not from. based on reality. Well, uh, or our, ours. Um, we could see Hillian having a tough restart and I think drops a few positions there. Um, 
Yeah, I like the position change. Yeah, and but Landon, with that, though, spots. we'll be keeping an eye on Tasos already up into six. So this is what we're talking about. We got to go back up to Miller because Miller is right on the back of um, Limp. And this is going to be an interesting thing now, too, because Dearest is not in, in, is active right now, but it will be on the next lap. And he's a, he's still holding on to the back of him. Oh, so yeah. he's, I, he's just being patient, man. Yeah, I he's think he's just waiting. So and the thing is, he only has one lap. Yeah. Oh, he's already going for it. I think he's. It makes oh, some. Empty. Doesn't make it though. It, it kind of. It, so what he did is he forced him to have to go. Like he's just compromising him. Yeah. Um. I don't think he wants to do that too many times. I oh. Think he's... What? What? Did Didn't Thomas about? pass Renzo? No. no, he never passed no. him. Renzo held him off. Yeah. And now Thomas looks like he's having Tesos to defend. Tesos is still moving up though. Yeah. Tesos is. Tesos split the Williams. Yeah. All right, Landon's. I'm gonna move off positions. of them because I think this pass might happen first. Ah, oh, he's so close to him though. I have to be here. I have to be here. We cannot miss this if this position changes. I I can be sad. I mean, it's a soft versus a medium. It's gonna happen eventually. Like, <laughs> it's it's not it's. it's oh, here logic. we go. Enabled, so he won't get it here, but he'll get it on his next two. So we'll get these next two DRS zones. We're going to be expecting... Uh, Tesos already passed him. Yep. Tesos passed him before the first DRS. Uh, I don't know. What the, I don't know. It's when you have seven windows open and there's one notification sound. It's hard to know what one it is. One notification. <laughs> who knows who it is. Oh, and we have Valheri retires. So that Red Bull, I think, was in position. Um, maybe it minute. wasn't. Either way, there's still a whole race to go. Um, Landon moving up another position to seventh. Ooh, Finn fights him off, puts him back in heat. Yeah. Kumar gets past Finn also. Uh, Talani making up. Out. Talani making no. up into the points now no. from all that. Oh, Landon, no. And Luke. <clears throat> all oh, the, no. the back drivers I dropping wonder, off like flies. I wonder <laughs> if there was like an incident out there. I don't know. That's no one check, guys. But we are here with the last lap here. We're going to be following Fallen Angel, limp another here. Another three-second penalty. <clears throat> or Sunbee, I should say. And now that we are here with Limp, can he get... I know this is only a qualifier points, but can he points points, do something to beat him? Oh, and Kumar retires. I think Miller is going to be making that move here soon. Or is he just... If is he? Why is he falling back? Yeah, he's falling back. Why is he falling back? Get after it, Miller. Is there something that I don't know? I don't know. There's always something I don't know. Oh, nice. <laughs> All right, he's moving up. Last lap, though. Now or never. Setting himself up really close racing, coming quick through the corner. Nope, and that's gonna be it, I think. Yeah, he's gonna come through. That was weird, he he lost a significant portion, maybe. <clears throat> yeah, a I don't weird know what happened, maybe. Of it. I, yeah, I have no idea what happened. Maybe he just kind of lost his line a little bit. It is and only one point here, so oh, yeah, this one's not much. as important as like in the race. Tasos does make it all the way back up into uh, third. Yeah, Tezos, I, Tezos and Renzo, I think we're able to like pull off some pretty good, um, you know, returns after all. But I'm impressed with the Millers. Finn with the uh, driver of the day for the sprint, I well deserved, moving up nine points. I think both the Williams drivers did really well. Oh, that's the one. Ooh, the broadcast. Here, I should probably send the link. <clears throat> Okay, let's do this before. Um... Alrighty. I can't see what I'm typing. Yes, yes. <clears throat> 
Oh man! Ad break. <clears throat> good, good call. Or is it an ad break? I think it's he's happening might, he's right getting now. Getting one. Oh, he's doing man. it for us. Uh, yeah. Good timing. Good, good, good timing, timing, actually. Yeah. Good timing for our lack of <laughs> attention. We used to be really good at doing mm. like shoving three ads through all at once. We need to start doing that again. Yeah. At the beginning. Stuff happens. Yeah, I mean, it's it was kind of a busy morning. What's going on? What's going on? Oh, what's what's hey. going on? How's it going, man? Man, busy as shit, bro. Yeah, I can feel you. So we're here in, we just finished the sprint. Your team looked like they were doing really well. And then I think you lost a few points there in the sprint at the end of that. Um, so you guys could have gotten a lot better points, I think. Um, with, a, what, one third of the race going to end here? Yeah. How do you feel about your team? Like, you guys probably missed a few points here and there, I think, that you could have gotten. Yeah, I feel like I feel like the team for its first time trying to compete into a championship series, especially with each other. Uh, you kind of you should you could go in with the expectations of like always like, oh, we're going to we're going to run it up. But I think the best thing to do is like at this point in time, let's just get the experience, see which drivers are going to be um, attending on a consistent basis. And then, and then go from there so that you can kind of better know how to hone in your team for next season. So I hate to say it's kind of like Mercedes S right now with the W13, W14 situation. <laughs> that's the way we're going to go about it right now. So uh, it's good yeah. to see Helium get points. Uh, it's good to see at least the drivers communicate with each other about if they're not going to be there to communicate mm -hmm. with the driver. Uh, so that's been a plus. Yeah. So yeah, man, I, that's where, we move, where we're kind of going from there. Yeah, I'd say that that's one big pro, uh, uh, positive for your team. You've pretty much had a driver consistently drive for your team every time. And you guys just haven't been able to get some points. It's hard to get points, especially in the champions division. Like even the drivers who got like eight in this one, like it's it's a tough one to get just that little bit of points. Um, so even just one point mm -hmm. is, is hard to get. So. I think you guys are good. You guys are in position, I think, three or four uh, in Constructor. So I think if you guys just continue to keep coming into the races, I think your luck will it'll be like this little switch. We had it last season with our Alpine group. They were they had like, I think they scored like 70 points in the first half of the season, and then they scored 170 in the second half. So oh, it, that's nice. it, it just changes, you know. It, so I think, and we're going to be going in here, Hillian in a good spot in six going into this uh, race. And I think he's shown really good racecraft. So I think his strategies have always been good into these races and he kind of sifts himself through. Yeah, he definitely does that. Hillian's been one of the strong, strong ones kind of running That's up in here. And hate it. So I'm really looking forward to see him do well. Um, I wish that... Oh! Uh, Oh, oh, who was that? Dude. Who was that? <laughs> that <laughs> That's is not good. With the Alfa Romeo running right oh. into the McLaren. Looking pretty much how the McLaren started off their season. That's about what it's going to look like. <laughs> oh, so, my yeah. gosh. Uh, looks like, sad to say, somebody tried to pull off a Joe right at the beginning of the race. And then pretty much. <laughs> oh, we got. <laughs> oh, we got oh. somebody running. I'll try it, William. Hey, yeah. Yeah, this is that. Neither of are out, though. Part of a race. That's not bad. Yeah. That first corner, they didn't even wait to the first corner. They just said, we're going to get right off. That they was didn't off. even line. They didn't even want a corner. We see here again, uh, Miller having a bad start. Tesos gets him. Um, and Finn getting a really good jump here. These two Williams drivers, uh, they're new. Oh, that looked like Hillian. That's yeah, unfortunate. He was. He oh. nice. Yeah, definitely. That was Hillian. He's falling far back. Yeah, something yeah. happened it, there. Something happened to Landon as well because he takes a deep dive down to 18. And uh, oh, last man. time I checked the, the uh, movie Men of Honor, so I, I know that um, <laughs> he's, <laughs> there's no diving exercises happening here. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. Sadly, your well. team looks like they're going backwards instead of forward uh, for now, but it's yeah. very early in the race. Hills, Hills, yeah, it's early in the race. Hills in the pit, so hopefully it's a front wing situation. He can get get some things changed, get some parts changed, get some uh, probably if he's gonna switch out those tires, switch out of those hard tires, maybe into a medium. 
we'll see what he does coming out of there. But um, yeah, that's a rough break right there. Uh, it's not as rough as the start, but it's, it kind of almost is worse because you thought you might have started just getting into your groove and then you're not. So, <laughs> And then yeah. you're going backwards again. Right. We see Sunby with the stop go. I wonder what, did you see Here's what it was the crash. Like? Oh, it's from the crash. Yeah. Oof. Oh, he was the one who crashed was, with Luke. Yeah. Oh. Yep. Bro, you like hate to see it. Between uh, Broken and his partner right there. That's almost looking kind of like Lando and Piash for the first race. Yeah. Low key. Oh, yeah, the gap. But uh, that was because of yeah. the crash, the incident. I think Luke is technically yeah. has more points than him in the series so far. In the series. Yeah. Oh, that's that. Yeah. That was some. Friendly, that was some pretty pretty friendly wheel to wheel action between the Aston Martin and that McLaren yeah. right there. That corner. Yeah, these two. That's... So our top three have been racing together at least a full season for a so. while. They're, so they all know how to race with. They're each comfortable other. with each other in tight corners, which is nice. Yeah. But we can see here, this is exactly what Limp wanted. He wants these two drivers to fight each other because if the longer right. they fight. He doesn't need to worry about it. It's like, well, right. I'm on these hards. I want to go really late into this race and pit late. Um, but Miller's staying on Tesos, and he's got the worst tires. And Tesos, yeah, Tesos has a better compound. But because they're fighting here, Ooh. oh, and Tesos looks like he's conceding. Now he's just defending. He doesn't want to lose this position. But it looks like he's going to, even with the better Ooh. tires. Miller's right there with him. Yeah, he's right on him. But you can he's see Renzo looking, there trying to catch up. Yeah, he's going to catch the slip and DRS him, and he's probably going to go ahead and go by him. Yep, yeah, there it is. Fine. How do you feel about this triple, like this triple DRS zone? <laughs> oh, I, I mean, don't, I don't really feel, I don't, I don't feel anything about it. Um, I think it's, I think it's fine. I, I really don't like tracks with one, one DRS on. I wish, honestly. Yeah was reformatted for actual one-to-one -one scale Formula One as it is. Uh, I think it's a yeah. little bit, it's too predictive and, and it's always like either somebody's got the gun and somebody's the rabbit or not, you know? And I think there's a better way to implement that DRS procedure and, and make racing more exciting and also give the drivers better advantages and to ward off disadvantages. So I think uh, that's something that they need to look at reformatting. So to me, it, it doesn't matter. Yeah. It's gonna that's happen regardless. Matter. Who spun? Yeah, no, Talani oh, crashed out. What are the, is that the I don't. Oh, it's. We can make it. We can make it. We can't make it. It's gone. It? Oh, but we have another driver. Um. Oh, Williams what's going on honest. here? <laughs> Williams is, is that? The, that's the Duracell battery just. I don't out understand what's going on here <laughs> either. The Duracell battery. The moonwalk, <laughs> the moonwalk into the pebbles. The that's gotta the be the, you know what I bet it was that's if he be. went forward while he was on track it would have DQ'd him maybe so he was just that was the roll longest roll. oh he's just cra okay we gotta get off of him the guy's having a <laughs> veteran race oh, the guy's having a having oh, a tough time this, right here this action oh. he stay with the cam the action <laughs> 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 we, don't get off we have Jonas here position. passing Lord <laughs> so Jonas here was out of position into that he he should be up here with the front runners um, is slowly get gotten back up into fifth now. We'll be looking to attack uh, Renzo next. Went on to the medium, so it makes sense though, right? Starting all the way back in, what is that, 17th? Something like that? I don't recall. 18th? Is that Lord? Yeah, that Lord is, do you all know that Lord? Is that Lord? I don't know. Yeah. There's two Lords that I know of. I don't know if okay. which one is which. Which Lord is which? <laughs> yes. Uh, it could be. That one? Some say I have there's no only idea. one. There's yeah, many, yeah. many of these drivers have many names, <laughs> and I do know right. there's two different lords, <laughs> so I don't know if that's the correct one or not. <laughs> yeah, well, we had um, we had a first, but they uh, they did show one time, and now it'll never show again. It's kind of hard to live that down when you don't show up to a challenge. I just wondered if that was him or not. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't think so. That's pretty. Yeah, cool. I don't think oh, so either. We so we already have a lapper here. That is. Yeah, that's what that, I was just saying. What you having a bad? Some... That's the you had a bad day. <laughs> Sing hey. a sad song. <laughs> that guy's that guy is already. Uh, he's on a Sunday drive now. Instead, uh, yeah. we have Thomas yeah. here. 
Yeah, Alfa Romeo is not having a not having a great day, but you know, still a lot of yeah. race left. Hopefully, they can you know pull it back together. Mm -hmm. I believe in them. I would keep an eye on Luke here because Luke is going to be looking to try to gain a point or two after that incident early. Mm -hmm. But we have. Yeah. Let's see. Is there I'm any gonna, gaps I, here? I'm surprised Sunbeam was um, able to move up see. from <laughs> having been involved in that incident. So early. <laughs> it looks yeah. like Lord and uh, Thomas. Oh, it was for a moment. It looked yeah, like they, they were pretty been, close. They were pretty yeah, close. Yeah, and Ren Renzo's pretty close to Tesos, but yeah, I think I Tesos guess. will be. I don't think the crossover has happened yet. Um, All right. So I don't think he will be catching him. Oh, he is catching him. Though. Oh, that's just DRS, yeah, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's the power. This is the power of DRS right here. Honestly, if you're yeah. even on like worse tires, you can kind of keep up. <clears throat> you just can't. You have to be perfect though. So this is a track that's similar to like Brazil, where this is a like sweaty track. Yeah. Like you, f these drivers are gonna finish the, the race, so and their backs are gonna just be drenched, yeah. hard, <laughs> <It's> just, <Yeah. laughs> or their hands, I, I guess, or some of them. <laughs> <laughs> their hands, to some of them. Looking walls, I've seen ever nice. That banner and those walls look mighty yeah? good. Doesn't look yeah. clean. That's, yeah, you like your little section. Your little section. Yeah. Yeah, oh, and look at that right there. There's a couple really good spots, actually. There's some the very good camera, camera, camera spots. Into the wolf pack stuff. I like Any it. of the boards with the uh, that are the light up, the ones that switch, yep. they all look, they look so, so good. Clean. They're so bright. Shout out to Miller. Yeah. Shout out to Miller for putting the time. Yeah. Out. And shout so out nice. to Wolfpack. We're about to come through his corner right here. Go sub to him. At Ooh. Wolfpack Performance. Go on check YouTube. out Wolfpack Performance. <laughs> if you can, yeah. But we have here with Limp and Miller. Oh, this has become our usual at this point. We we expect them to be at the front. They are together again. Yeah. Together at last. Let's no, see I him did. fight. So Limp won the battle yeah, in the sprint. We'll see if he can beat him in. No, the... that twitch right there just might have hand. It just might have crippled him up just enough to put him back in middle feet. That was a nice little. That was a nice little twitch right there. That definitely didn't help him out. Yeah. At this point in time, the way Miller's driving, he's just really sticking in there, waiting for the opportunity that he wants to take. And I'm pretty sure it's gonna come down this main straight when he flops that DRS swing over. He's gonna go for it. It should. Yeah. Yeah. I know what, what we were saying earlier is that Miller. He's a patient driver. He's gonna. Yeah. He's gonna wait until he knows he's gonna be able to make his move, and he's just gonna make one move and he's gonna get it done. There you go. And Limp has been very good against him, though, and has yes. obviously, as we've seen, has gotten the An best incredibly out of talented it driver. on each one. Yeah, he's he's um, probably definitely using energy to defend off that. Just a little bit. So. I think he's he's been very good Amazing. with with racing against uh, Miller, and has been been able to like save, conserve his energy. But I think with how many laps he has to have him behind him, there's no way he can continue this all the way through. There will be a swap and there'll probably be another swap some, somewhere around right. the line. And it's really what happens near the end of this race, I think. Um, so I think okay. if these drivers will probably stay with each other. Maybe we go look at this little uh, DRS um, with Lord, Valeri, Thomas, and oh, Lannan. Yeah, oh. And, okay. See, this is the thing though. Watch, because we're not on here now. Miller is going to pass him. And it's because we're watching yeah. this DRS. We're watching another DRS. <laughs> it's going to be a Dave or Copperfield. We'll go back and the switch will have yeah. happen. Yeah, it looks like he's just on behind him, though. I don't think I don't think he's passing. I don't expect him to pass no, no. really anytime soon. But you this little mid pack, I think, is doing good. We, ha we have your driver here coming through. Is all the way into ninth now, so is back into the points. Um, yes. I don't believe he pit yet. He no, he no, just, I think he had so that down. incident that, that sent him a little bit backwards and now he's gone back forward. Um, I expect him to gain maybe a few more positions here. Oh, and you can see there. Oh, Ooh, the Red Bull went off. The Red oh. Bull went off. Might have been oh, a little bit of a, oh, a touch. There, yeah. And with that, oh. we can see here, it takes two positions from that benefit. The guys oh, in the back I, of a DRS train always benefit the most I, from a DRS I, train. <laughs> 
Three second time penalty again. Uh, Dizzy Mason is just racking up the penalty. He's he's he, he's trying to do yeah. his Esteban Esteban mm -hmm. impression. He can't. Yeah. Oh, that, thin? that was Thomas. Thomas. Thomas having a moment and just. Oh, yeah. In the and as we expect from the Williams, they got close to the top, Rough. and now they're just slowly falling back. We have Mason retiring, Mason's so he does the. Right. He, yeah. I guess he's done giving penalties to the, yeah, to the directors, and then he's done giving so, them the opportunity to give him penalties. To give him penalties. <laughs> uh, like, I'm just gonna call it there. Oh man, I I saw two and I forgot. They're, they've been this close the entire time. We have Landon on Lord though. This is actually could be a pass. Go tries to do the inside out. Gets actually a really good exit. Ooh. Oh, he's the. He, oh, he's it almost gonna, looked like he. Look a little contact right there. Oh, yeah, it looked yeah. like he almost. Oh, but he's blinking though, and that blinking means he has less than ten percent in his reserve right. of his battery for his motors, which is about what two hundred. Horsepower, something like that, run. Might be even mm -hmm. more at this point. The electric motors give produce. Yeah, uh, I mean they're it's not gonna it's have a lot. that benefit. He's not gonna have that benefit. Yeah, so this is where it's like, when do you pass them? Because honestly, this one's terrible. You don't want to pass here. Right. The next one might be is the easiest one to pass, but then you have to defend through the second DRS zone or the last DRS zone. Um, but it looks like he has no battery and might actually be able to complete this and He's also around. protect. Around. He's, around. He's around him. So now we got to yeah, see so if he's we'll going to be able to the motor. Is he going to end up kind of... He's got a good gap. Up. I doubt he... Yeah, there's no... He's definitely using yeah. ERS to keep him off of him. And just like that, gets it to six. So a he is doing a really good job here. Renzo... Oh, whoa! Renzo spinning taste oh, us out. Oh, he puts it in. Christmas colors are not bringing gifts this year. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. Last time I checked, really, really <laughs> festive time. Yeah, that, that was, was uh, that's definitely, that's definitely going to end up a penalty, I think, which means, yeah. oh, look at Lord. Yeah. Lord actually gives up the position back, but he's yeah, going so into the pits, so they end up with this weird, oh, that was sloppy. That was uh, not good for either of their drivers. And we nah. see Finn now getting out. is out. I don't. I think he did a retirement in the pits. So some of these drivers just not able to handle it. And this is where opportunity comes into play, right? So mm -hmm. I mean, look at these drivers are all here. We're we've lost um, up to four drivers now. All these guys who had a rough time in the beginning, they're they can easily get a point now. Yep. Like you still have to fight. But you're in a you're in a position to get points. We have Lannon now and Jonas. We saw Renzo, so you got to keep an eye on that. That whatever his gap is, he's gonna have to probably compensate mm -hmm. for around five seconds or so, at least for a, like after race penalties, because that is definitely not something you want to do. Didn't that look that, great, that don't look yeah. like he <laughs> didn't look like didn't nice look very good. But we can see these two drivers with Jonas and Lannon both doing really good, getting 14 and 10 together. We have, I did switch up here. He he was looking. I switched up here. He he, he gave it a little peek. A little peek. A little peek. Yeah, he gave it a little peek. But he gave it a little peek. But we are here with them, and they're just they're both just really good. They have both have very uh, high amounts of energy. Couldn't get it. Yeah, like their energy, they're just, they're just together. He's, I think they're just pushing together. It's pretty impressive. That's uh, wild that it actually has it in kilojoules listed. Yeah, it's kilojoules stored, man. But that's crazy that it lists that as the battery reserve. Yeah, since we know Miller or Limp doesn't listen to this, um, they're both just full battery, by the way. Yeah, like they're, they're both just, just driving around. They're driving around here with full battery. Like this is just all that's all that's happening. These guys are fast. Oh, 11 second gap. Yeah. Already. That's wild. I don't see any of these other drivers catching them. This is just this is no. like They're this is stick. definitely Ver, this is Verstappen Hamilton esque right here. They're just these two guys are just so far ahead of the rest of the group. Yeah, it's we're not. only watching we're only expecting one of these two drivers to win the race at this point. Well, that's how racing <clears> works. <throat> 
No, but usually oh, you can have a third or four. Just the two. I see what you're saying. <laughs> just the two. My apologies. <laughs> yeah, that's how racing works. Yeah, you're right. Usually there's just one. Usually only one wins, yes. It's usually the Highlander wins. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, is there any race in uh, Vilhetti? Mm -hmm. Looks like he might be... No, they're, they're still not close enough. You, yeah, you gotta be... You gotta be like two hundredths, I think. To make it Yeah, you gotta be really close before. Right. Yeah, if you're looking but at anything Tesos above... up into ninth, so he did pit already. Um, so I think this is a good time, yeah, we gotta, you gotta be thinking about when you're pitting, right? So we had Thomas go into a pit, Tesos went into a pit, and Hill has done his pit. Luke is on his second pit already. Um, should be able to make it to the end. Jonas goes onto a pit. So here, this is where everybody starts to pit. I think around 18. I think even the hard runners went all the way up to in, easily into the 20s on, on the those hard hards. Uh, la yeah, know, yesterday's race. We're gonna be seeing a, a, a pit of chicken between Limp and Miller. Like, which one of um, them is gonna decide to pit first? I think Miller will pit first, and he'll go into the mediums. Uh, I think he's gonna wait this time. Right? I don't think Miller's gonna go in yet. You know, you're right. I think Limp usually pits before him, right? When he's ahead. It's hard to know. It's definitely yeah. like how you feel. I think how do you both feel comfortable the on their tires, though? Is what I mean. Like, I don't think either of them are gonna go you know, just yet. I agree. I don't think either of these drivers. What's the wear on the tires? Not bad at all. Thirty-three percent. These guys could easily oh, go yeah. to the. These guys could go <laughs> to the end of the race right. on these tires if it feels legal. Right. Like, if it was legal. <laughs> if they okay, wouldn't get in trouble. Stop. If they wouldn't get disqualified for it, these guys could go to the end. These they're showing pace and longevity. And consistency. And we have Landon here coming in now for the Mercedes team. Let's see where he comes out. Lord comes in with response to that. And we'll be going on to the hearts. Unlikely to happen in real life, but hey, things could happen more consistently. <laughs> oh, Kumar had a wing damage, so you oh, might see a little damage. bit more pace. Oh yeah, from the incident. <laughs> from the incident. <laughs> and then we have Alex. So here, yeah, it, all the mediums are definitely coming in. And Sunbi is the last of the, the top runners or the medium out. runners that are still out there. Um, I'm really surprised with what he's been able to pull off so far today. Going yeah. from fairly far back in a rough incident early on to ninth. Well done. But we do have yeah. these two gaining to up to 13 now. They're just slowly pushing that up. A lot of these drivers, so these, these penalties are going to matter coming into the end. Well, look at this gap, though, too, yeah. between Renzo and Jonas. You know, that's right. Have they, I did. So Jonas did pit. pit. Jonas is, has pit. Um, so that's where that you're seeing now. You're seeing the pit. Mm -hmm. So we're going to want to keep an eye on that, right? Because when does Ren, when does Renzo pit? When, do, when be is going, the one through three pit, really? When, yes, that's true. One through yeah. three. When do they pit? Um, Jonas will most likely undercut him, but he will be on the mediums going in through the end of the race. So... We'll probably see this, maybe Renzo and Jonas end up fighting near the end of this race. We have Landon now on the attack of Tesos. Yeah, yeah. Okay, he's just barely he enough room there, but he does get the pass off. And I don't think, yeah, Tesos is not gonna be able to defend this because he has DRS and they're both, I believe, just went on to the new tires. So you're not really gonna wanna fight a uh, driver right now. Um, no, he tried to go back in real quick just to get into that slip. I have it as low as can be. Ooh, there it goes. There. Oh, what did Miller do? What did Miller do? Oh, God. Oh, we, we, missed, we missed it. it. He finally did it. it. Well, yeah, so what he did was he outbroke him is probably what happened. And he's going to, he's not going to give oh. it up. Oh, here we go. He's attacking before the pit. Yeah. Okay, so this is one thing I do know, though, too, is Miller is really fast 
open air. Yes. Like we yeah, are got to, flies. I'm a hundred percent positive. We're about to see a fast slap go down right now right. by one of these yeah, two drivers. One of these two drivers is about to do a fast slap. Yeah. And I think Miller, it might be Miller. Yeah. <laughs> Miller in the fun is like free Willie with no Captain Ahab in sight. It's just gonna go, <laughs> it's just gonna happen. <laughs> So we did miss his initial pass, but it was probably just a dive into and the inside. And their already just increasing just on that pass. Oh my the gosh. The increase. Yeah. Already, they're already to like one second. They're almost. definitely going on a fast lap right now together. <laughs> so uh, Miller does have the fastest lap so far. Renzo we have Renzo into the, into the pits. And that gap is over a second. Yeah. It's getting bouncing. Renzo goes onto the mediums. We come back to this. We'll see. Limp does the fastest uh, personal best through sector one. Limp or Miller oh, does it. So Miller. Three second time penalty. Damn it. Oh, yeah. Took a penalty. Let's see. So he's matching with their. Oh, yeah. He's matching with all the people in front of him. And he was right behind him to where he didn't have to pass the drivers in front. Now he will have to actually race them. And Miller, look at that gap. See, this is what I was talking about. Once it happened, yeah. and look at Limp's like, I need to go in. I need to change my, and they're the fastest lap. That's like there we said. We he knew he was going to try to push a fast lap. And what's happening here now is Limp's going to come in, put on these tires. Miller's probably going to do one more, either one more lap, or he's going to yeah. just pit here. He's, he's going to, all right. of his ERS right. is about to disappear. He's going <laughs> to, you sh we might even see his light blink eventually at one point. Um, yeah, he's gonna push. Because he's, um, you wanna put, this is a push lap. He needs to push right. push out to make sure he stays in front because the benefit of this year is when you, you when you come out, your, you, your out lap is very slow now compared to last year. So right. him doing a push lap here, going into the pits, he should easily be able to still come out in front of Limp. It's when he starts doing extra laps when you would be concerned about getting undercut. Yeah, you gotta you gotta pick pick that spot that sweet spot real. You stay out too long, you lose it. Uh, you go in yeah. too early, maybe. But I think he's in a good position. Uh, if he just went yeah. ahead and brought it, came out. Oh, what the? Go. He's going into the pit. I figured he was gonna go right in. Oh no! He, oh, we got a DQ. Locking oh, that's that unfortunate pit. for Paul. Yeah. No. He's out of there, buddy. You're out. That's two unfortunate races in a row for him today. Miller's on the mediums. Now we're going to see if Limp's going to be coming down this straight. And I think that might be As, him coming down. Yep, that's him coming down. Not, so it's, you got a car right there. He's he does have a car in front of him. Yeah. But yeah, look at that gap. Look at the gap yeah, that was created from that. That's. There I know he had like a second before he went into that pit. But he gained a whole nother second somehow through it. It was just his yeah. push. He pushed super hard again two times in a row. And like that, we can see the gap between them now. It's 15 yep. from the rest of the pack. Yep. Right. So going all the way back to Renzo, that is just 15. We do have Landon. Looks like he's doing a push onto Renzo. The problem is, is he's on the hard. So even when he catches him, it's going to be very difficult to pass. Yeah, it's uh, I think yeah. just fourth alone is good here with that 11 spot gain like that's that's a win for for um this this race it is. If, yeah if we even have Jonas make, here with, if Phil could make up two more spots to get 10 if it was even somewhere possible for him to make up two more spots and just cap that off of that last points position that would be good for the team yeah. period yeah, and we can see here, uh, Limp is trying to get back into it with a push through there, getting the fastest lap of a 106.604. Lord takes a penalty. So that's also very important, right, with these penalties here. Does does Hill, Hill has three, so he's smashing with everybody else. We have Renzo all the way up to a nine. So Renzo's already losing his position to yes. one driver. Might be losing it. Oh, Jonas takes a penalty as well. So <laughs> this is where everything starts. This is where it becomes crucial. How many warnings? How many penalties? He almost lost it there. Thomas almost lost it through that corner. And now he's going to have to be keeping an eye on that. Oh, he he's got a really good exit there. And this Red Bull is is definitely going to be attacking. Yeah, he is. 
And he's antsy. He can't even And he's wait. already going to get him, but because of that, he is going to... Thomas will have DRS here, so might be, be able to really? attack him back. Broken goes even faster, responds to that fast slap of 106.083. Yeah. yeah, Broken's about to run it up. So Hill goes into a pit. I think that was actually a smart idea here. So if Hill has any chance, he's gonna need to, yeah, just, he's gonna have to put in some good lap times to get make this up. So yeah, going in, it, getting some mediums, he might be able to get it. I'm wondering if he can serve that penalty time in the, in the pits as well. No, it's uh, exceeding track limits penalties you can't get rid of. Yeah, he's got to hold that then. So there's not going to be a position change due to that, so he's going to be stuck in that place. Um, yeah, but he there's plenty of time still uh, to maybe make up the gap. He has, he's on mediums. Um, some of these hard drivers are going to start feeling that, like Thomas is on 13 laps old hard, oh, so that's yeah. a pretty slow pace. Seven laps. Mm. Yeah, yeah, seven. So, so maybe. Uh, I mean, I think it was a smart idea to be proactive. So he went into the pits, got some tires. If any of these drivers start feeling like their tires are going bad, they're gonna have to pit, and they're most likely gonna end up behind Hill now that he pit. Yeah. Because so he's he gonna might. be able to get under. Yeah. So I think it's a good, a good strategy to try to get points here, um, coming into the end of this. Because some of these tires are going to just fall off really hard, and you don't want your tires to damn. fall off on this track. Yeah, damn. Bro. Miller's pushing it out there. Yeah, I don't think he wants to lose this this race. No. That's for sure. <laughs> He's lost two, three in a row now. Or, yeah, I don't think he wants to lose. He lost in Japan, which is the track that he, none of us expected him to lose on. Uh, by far one of the fastest drivers I see in, in Japan. Period. Yeah, he could probably even compete. It's he one could, of his favorite tracks too. Japan, he could easily compete with like some of the esports drivers there. And it's like one not, of his favorite not tracks, necessarily right? win, but it's compete. one of his favorite tracks. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And he's fast. So it makes sense. It makes Very sense, fast. It makes sense <laughs> that he likes it. Yeah, and he lost there. But I mean, it wasn't because <laughs> he wasn't faster. It was racing happens, right? Oh, yeah. and we see right. Landon takes a penalty. Um, Dang. So everybody has has hit has gotten a penalty besides the two uh, the drivers up front, which I think speaks to their consistency. Yeah, they're not just fast; they're, they're keeping good. it on the track. <laughs> right, they're good. They're everything you want. <laughs> they're they're just, not just fast; they're good. There is a difference. <laughs> yeah, and we have here Jonas trying to attack on Lord here. Um, the two Austin Martins doing a really good job because didn't they drop back and then now they've dropped, come back up front? No, they've always been kind of up there, huh? Oh, yeah. I'm thinking of the, the Williams like, who... I'm bad at racing, yep. but I'm better at time trials, but I'm still <laughs> bad at both. <laughs> you know what I mean? Two things it's, can be... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> One's better than the other, but they're both bad. <laughs> I can finish a race. But it'll always be in the back. <laughs> same, same. No, I've finished many races in last. Yeah. I, I may beat like four drivers. No. But I'll still be like 16th. No, I'm, 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 I'm 18, 19, 20th, and I'm only yeah. 18th or 19th if people don't finish. <laughs> oh, hey, you know? So, I, mean, I know my limitations. It's okay. Yeah. There's a reason why I'm behind the mic. I've said it before. I'll say it again. Yeah. Yeah, no. Those they can do, those they can't talk about, those who can, and we're talking about. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, See, he gets I'll it. talk Very about. I'll talk about how bad these drivers mm -hmm. are all day long. It's like it's like my it's my favorite part of watching the Olympics. You know. Oh, here we go. We have a. Did he? Is he actually just oh, in? Thirteen. What happened here? Oh my gosh. Whoa! Yeah. That was not safe at all. Oh no! That was Esteban Light. That was Esteban. That was, Esteban that was very Light. dangerous. Woo. Yeah. Should have a commentators league. A commentators movie. league. <laughs> there's is there's a like a what is it called a YouTube league that exists for all the social. The oh damn! 
It's a wrap. That was that was dangerous. That was definitely dangerous. That was worthy of a oh see oh they're just see this is a part of the race where these drivers oh, are Oh, oh, they're, they're about oh to tussle. They're my They're about to touch. They're about to Oh, they're, oh, oh you got it, buddy. What oh, happened? My God. And there oh, it is. It so if you were asking it. for this all to come together. What was that? Here it is. So so this is, I I'll, hate I'll, I'll, I hate I'll explain it. The car. I, they, oh, it always does. It always does. It does. So this is what happened, right? These drivers were getting tired. And they didn't want to be behind drivers anymore. And then they just carelessly crashed into each other. Yeah, man, and clear up. Exhausting. So, this, so there's one driver here that this is horrible for. And that is I Renzo. <laughs> the the guy is. Yeah. Oh. They go onto the softs, so they're gonna be. Now we're just in a sprint. This is a full on secondary sprint. We saw um, Limp won the first. We'll see if Miller can win the second one. He said secondary. This right here in the back on softs is a desperate sprint. Is it? To try this to <laughs> the, the, this is the. So anybody who does not pit right now and puts on softs is gonna they're get done. blown away. Like they. They're done. Yeah. You gotta yeah. pit. You gotta dive in. Just go. Yeah. You gotta go there's, red there's label. Seven laps go. Of, there's seven yeah. laps to No, you have to pit. It's the only thing that makes sense. If you're not pitting, you're gonna get passed. It's just gonna happen. Oh. Uh, hey, so that makes sense though. So Alex just said um, he hasn't pit yet because he's trying to get back around. <laughs> And it's like, yeah, that one makes sense, but he can't. He's stuck behind the two because okay. they are so mm -hmm. fast. See, now that's unfortunate right there. No. Yeah, it is. So I wonder. So I wonder if the two front runners got off track and let him through. I wonder Blame if left. No way. Oh, hopefully he comes back. That's sweet. Must be a or connection or just issue. in the menu real quick. No, no, no. It wouldn't go. Oh, it no, no, no. If you're in a menu. no. He knows he left though. I think because it probably it yeah. See, oh, he crashed. He had to have crashed. The the, the man crashed. Oh, and he. Now, I dude. Hopefully he's able to get back in before the like race starts. <clears throat> now he should be able to. I don't think that's going to happen. He's playing now. I mean, he has a full lap to before he has to worry about it. So Lord comes in. So yeah, I think everybody has finally taken their pits. What is going on? What is that? What is this? Okay, so what's happening right here uh -oh. is it's called F1, the video game. And they're huh. all getting destroyed right now by <laughs> the bot. The bot is murdering all these drivers. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, there it goes some more wreckage. Some wow. More Limp, I, Limp just uh, single handedly destroyed all these drivers. Healed five seconds. Oh huh? my gosh. Well, <laughs> that's easily going to be appealed from all of these drivers. They're all getting it too. Oh for ignoring. Oh my god. This okay. game. This game. Um, this game. So that'll definitely be overturned for every one of those drivers. But gosh. EA, EA Sports. Sports. The, this, the safety Sports. cars, man, are just, they, I don't get it how it's programmed so badly. Limp's back. The Limp's safety back. car is the worst. Of, He's amongst the many bad things about this game, I think the safety car is the worst part. He's going to be very confused how there is two cars between him and the, the front. Uh, he's... Well, he's gonna wonder why he's a stop go. Did he get a stop go? Oh, he got one too. Wait, how did he get one? He did it. He did it. His bot did it. <laughs> he, I thought everybody was getting it His because AI of him. did it. I thought everybody was getting it because of him. Oh man, the safety car shenanigans. This is why halfway through our season we stopped even running a safety car. We did. Oh, we did. His bot's doing it again. This sucks. 
Yeah. So what is that? Three drivers definitely have it, but so that that'll go away. Like the stop goes are definitely going to go away. I mean, they'll get it in the game, but we'll remove it. So whatever they finish at. Cause none of those drive, none of those drivers deserved it. <laughs> none of them deserved a stop go penalty for ignoring yellows. That was just right. It's like, come on, safety car, safety car in this lap. All the drivers finally caught up. We have the Mercedes benefiting from this sh the shenaniganery that happened. Up to up to um, ten. <clears throat> Hill all the way up to 10 will has I think he got lapped somehow through all that that happened so we'll not be able to fight for any higher positions because sadly the game doesn't let cars through I mean they can't even get a normal safety car working properly so how are they gonna get it to be programmed to let cars unlap cars. themselves right and that's the damn thing that's kind of that's, that's kind of embarrassing yeah, because he could actually have been fighting for any of those positions if it wasn't for that. But so we could see here. Oh, and there goes that position. Yep. Damn it, Lennon. What are you doing, buddy? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, he was in fourth. He, he spun. And now he's in ninth. He spun he going into the first. He wasn't already going to take it from you, but you just gave it to him. The the man He's forgot right, that the right. tires were cold. He's right. He's right. <laughs> dude, I really hope for our gets their shit together, dude. Yeah. I really do. You and me both. We have this lapper here trying to just survive through the the ghosting system. <laughs> the guy's conf giving confusion through the rest of the pack. Oh, look at all the ghosting. Oh, and he goes... Hillian takes a penalty. And now is fighting Alex all the way in the back, too. But we should come back up here because it looks like he has caught it up to him. <laughs> and the real question is... Can Miller make that gap up again? Yes. If he wants to. Maybe. I mean... So there's a there was a lot of like strategy in play, right? When we didn't know a safety car was coming out. Yeah. But now here, just no racing. strategy. Just racing. Full you wear those tires out, use as much fuel as you can, because now you have as much of it as possible. Yeah, three laps left. If, if you underfueled, you have enough fuel still. Doesn't matter. Just go. We see Luke gets another position there. Um so this is kind of what we were talking about with the Mercedes group. It's it's they're they're you guys are just so close to doing well, and I think that's that's good though. That means it, when it starts clicking, we should see some nice finishes. From, from it should. Have. I said I'm 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 very satisfied with. Like I said, you got to win, starting small areas, consistency, showing up, and at least learning. So Hill and Landon, I think that's a good a good thing that they're doing. Uh, and I'll be looking forward to the next season to put all of that together and then see what we come up with. Here. Definitely. Mm. Excellence is a habit, not an act. Get it together. I mean, we've I like seen Hillian. Hillian, I wouldn't say he was a slow driver, but he was definitely not a driver that was um, league pace originally. And then coming yeah. into this, he's already shown that his his pace is actually there with league, league pace. So he's improved up to getting... A really good pace and now he just has to keep improving it and i think by the end of this he'll be just as fast as a lot of these guys we see renzo actually goes uh, yeah fast. i was gonna say i'm impressed with renzo <laughs> although he's got 12 seconds he's <laughs> 12 seconds 12 seconds, seconds of penalties yeah. uh, i'm impressed with the pace he's putting out right now i wonder what's going yeah. on with limp right now i don't know i'll back to him real quick it says renzo is blinking though so he's i don't know how you run your entire energy system out that quickly. Um, I, I know what's going on. Do you want another shenanigan? I know what's happening? wrong with it. I know what's wrong with it. So, it so Limp it. let him through. Uh huh. Oh. So that so they're they're giving up P P one. They said we're not gonna get it. Uh huh. So what they're trying to do is get two and three. So Limp's what gonna Limp is gonna do else. is fight for three. He's gonna just be fighting these this this DRS 
pack. And by fighting this DRS pack, he's hoping Renzo they can make that gap up by having Renzo just push as hard as possible. So that's what's happening. So he's gonna fight, defend, and try to hold this position without, and just slow the, the pack slow down. The pack down. Ah. But we can see here, Tezos is not having any of it and wants to already pass, but he isn't able to yet. But as we saw, Limp has really good pace. This is not a good passing zone. I don't think I don't advise it for anybody. I don't know why they all keep trying. This is also not a good one. <laughs> they get tired. Yeah, they get tired of waiting and they just poke their nose in and then they crash and you go, yeah. That's why you don't try to pass there. <laughs> yeah. What is that? Turn five or whatever? Turn four? four. One, two. God, four. Limp, just, I think it's turn four. Right? Uh, this, well done. In some ways, he's, he's pulling a check out right now. He's just being the ultimate team. Um, I totally missed that. Renzo. What happened to Renzo? <laughs> we both missed that. Yeah. Did you catch it? <laughs> I did Renzo that. went. So it you doesn't matter. Second to eighth. Now, now watch this. All right, now Limp's gonna now just watch pull this. Away. This gap magically increase. <laughs> <laughs> so Tesos now is has nine seconds of penalties, which is just how did we miss that? Means that Jonas, who was having a rough time, yeah. is all the way up into. Looks like he might get a podium. Podium yeah, here. Possible. Uh, it could well, be possible. He will right now because Tesos has the more penalties. Tesos has right more here, penalties right? at the moment, which means he would most likely so take it. So here's my question: How? Here's my question. I need to put up a poll. You do. You do. Need to put up a poll. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What was your question? Um, because the stop go for limp is just the his AI shenaniganery, right? Yes. So that won't matter. And the, yeah. same with the other two stop goes? Question mark? Anybody who got a stop go for ignoring a yellow flag, we can remove it like, after the race. Yeah. Oh, we we limp the fastest lap. Oh. Mm. That did we miss the finish of that race? And Miller oh, crossed oh. the line. <laughs> 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 That. Well done, Miller! <laughs> My bad, Derek Ritty. Good job, bro. Way to get that win. We did not ignore that at all. Not at all. Not we at were all. right there for it. We were there. <laughs> KGB, who is Jonas? Yes. With the uh, driver of the day for the game. <laughs> but the driver of the day poll is us. This was a weird race. This was a weird race. It was a good one, though. Look at this guy. Look oh, at this dude. guy. What a victory here. What is that? <laughs> Hi. Yeah. They used to give those out when you won back in the day. I don't know why. <laughs> hey, you know, plants are nice. Ooh, that hair. The hair, yeah. And congratulations to Miller here. Solid race. I think he did a really good job. Um, we definitely did not miss him go across the line. I saw it. Yeah. Just gas yeah. it. Audience. <laughs> no, <they're not>. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I guess it's all right to queue up the pit so I can do it all up. Yeah. Oh my God! Look at the look at that. <laughs> so many people. All right. So our order was, which is probably gonna change, right? Can I do it? Yeah. Miller, Limp, Jonas, Luke, Lord, Tesos, Kumar, Renzo, Lannon, Alex, Philhat, Sunby Hill, and then with our DNFs, Thomas Finn, Mason, Tolani, Luca, and Paul. So not quite able to get both your drivers into points, but you got yep. points nonetheless. I I, mean, I think this was always so gonna be a hard one. This was always gonna be a hard one to get points on, because it was just racing in the entire race. There's you're always fighting somebody. <laughs> There's not like you you don't get a break. I get what you're saying. Yeah. But it's just funny the way you phrased that. <laughs> it was bad. Yeah. I agree. Yeah. <laughs> I but you're like that, that you get my landing was just so it was it was right there and he just he just didn't mind the tire situation just yet. And yeah. He, he, he overzealous on it, man. Overzealous right. in the restart. Yep. Definitely. Where are these short shorts that uh Limp was complaining about. Oh, when you're in, way. when you're in like the lobby, you can like see mm. your your friends list. So that those those ones. It's pretty much those ones, yeah. Mm. 
Um, um, but yes, that was the limp. Limp disconnecting caused some safety car. Oh, he got back in though, but it didn't in. make any sense why it did that though. Like it should game be fine. His computer probably crashed. No, 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 no. But I'm meaning the game. So we had. I don't know if you were you saw any of the other stuff. So we had it to where <laughs> we had to restart. All of our guys got stuck in the in, in the, the pit. pit because because one guy got stuck. Because one guy got stuck, and then everybody got stuck behind him, and then they weren't moving. It was just everybody uh, was frozen in gotcha, the safety. Gotcha. It was weird. Yeah. Like so, we had to in the the pit. So we had to like restart yeah. the entire lobby. Yeah, it was terrible. Yeah, right. It's usually you can almost mm. kind of count on it these days. It seems like. Yeah, there's gonna be something each race. Yeah, it does seem like it's going back into that unstable state again. Yeah, like which it's is getting weird. worse instead of better. Yeah, it was stable for a long time. I don't know what's going on now, but. Well, but thanks for. Enjoy. Yeah, That's thanks fun. for joining us for that one. Um, we will probably ask you to come back in on the next sprint, and then we can kind of ask you about your team again. Be nice sure. to, to I hear have about it. More goodness to report. I'm and, hoping uh, you do too. I, either way, I expect to see a good race from all. You know, at the end of the day, you want to see a good overall race, even though you want your team to win, and that is cool. You just you want to see a good overall race that everybody across the field is kind of growing and are you know battling it out to be the best mm-hmm. that they can be. If I click on this, will it show up again? Yeah, it will. Oh, it won't, because you have to click on this. Yeah, you. no, the eyeball. Oh, the eyeball? Yeah. Oh, oh it's oh, broken. Oh. Yeah, no, hey, if it makes you feel better, your team did better than mine. Well, yeah. uh, I won't take it. <laughs> I won't take I it. Get, I don't want it. I expect I better. Shit. Yeah, I expect better. Don't I give me your I'm sympathy. Gonna, I'm going right. I'm going to take yeah. my daughter... Uh, we're gonna go get some ice cream. Hey, there you yeah. go. Yeah, thank you for joining us. Enjoy uh, your Saturday, bro. And yeah, I hope next time we have you on, we have better news <laughs> um, for yeah. your team, his team, all, Every, the teams. all the teams. I hope a lot all of teams. teams. I think did Haas score this weekend? I don't think they did. Right? They still don't have any points in this in Champions. They will That's eventually, Haas. maybe. That's Haas, though. Yeah, that That's Haas true. team. Yeah, it's hard to get it filled. So, all right. Well, all right. yeah. Safe. Thank you for joining us. Peace out. I'll Everyone, thank you for uh, joining us on the stream. As always, we got to give a shout out to our uh, our friends, our partners, our people. Wolfpack, as always, go check him out at Wolfpack Performance on YouTube. Like, subscribe, hit that notification button for him. As always, um, if you want to be like Miller, you know that sick driver out there who's just stupid fast. Check out SimCoaches.com for either you know some sweet new paddles. I think they got a wheel now. You know they're working on, that they got, and that's pretty cool. And if you want to start your digital adventure, check out Zinx at xinx.digital to do that. With you know, did you see that that nice branding and marketing that they did? Anyway, we are gonna go ahead and sign off here. Uh, as always, check out Delta Zero Productions.com. That's us. Like, subscribe, and uh, we'll catch y'all on the flippity flop. Bye. See you later, guys. <laughs>